Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to I Am Fish, guys. I'm having so much fun playing the full game. Today, we're going to be playing is one of my favorite, if not my favorite fish in the game, the flying fish. Guys, let's just jump into it. So we last left off on the level we played before, and we're moving on to the next level, level two. This is a level I've never played before. And hey, everyone who hit the like button last video, thank you so much. It means so much. It helps out a lot. If we actually set a like goal for the first time in a while, we set a like goal for 2,000 likes. So I'm thinking for this one, maybe we bump it up to 3,000. But hey, guys, if your fingers are tired, if your finger's tired from hitting the like button, don't worry about it. Just rest it up. Okay, so we're on into the depths. It looks like a sewer level. We did end up in a well. We jumped in a well. Oh my goodness. Okay. So we jumped in a well. Now we're underground. And let's fly. Let's fly. I can just skip this. I'm a flying fish maniac. I don't need that water. Dude, I don't need this water. I'm flying over everything. Although maybe I should get a drink. <laughs> maybe I should dip for a second. Whoa, is there a current? There's a current. Uh-oh. That makes things a little challenging. <laughs> okay. Let's see if I can... Make it up and fly. Ah. Whoops. <laughs> Not right into the box. Okay, let's try it again without bumping into a box. Wow. I got some good momentum there. Dude, we're going to make it out. Get me out of this. What did I just hit? Wait, what's sucking me? What? what? Dude, we're getting sucked through all these rocks and stuff? What? This is so cool looking. Good thing I'm not hitting the rocks and bumping my head and my eyeballs. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Oh. Huh. Wow. That was quite the drop. Dude. Look at this cave. Guys. Okay. Okay. This game is beautiful. Okay. We got to get some water. Please make it in. Drop in. Okay. I do like doing that from time to time. <laughs> I do like cutting it to the last minute. Guys, this game is so beautiful. You gotta be kidding me. I love the art direction they went with this. All right, we're flying. Oh, it's like a, it's like a mine shaft or something. Oh, dude, there's a breadcrumb. Uh, forget the breadcrumb, just live. Live. Whoops. Okay, we got launched. All right, so I think I gotta, I think I gotta hit one of these things these fountains right maybe not maybe i'm just going in the water okay i made it in oh <laughs> uh, maybe that fountain just sprinkled me a little bit okay no music maybe i'll add some of my own but right now in the game there's no music that it has kind of a i don't know kind of a cool feel to it dude look at this fish this guy's amazing. Okay. I'm not sure where we got to go, though. <gasps> I see pipe. Go in pipe? I can't I can't go in pipe. Maybe we'll fly around a little bit. Let's do some flying. Oh, I see a doorway. Okay, I see a doorway with a checkpoint. And we got to do some flying. We got to do some flying over this. <laughs> Guys, this might be my favorite level so far. What's up with those glowing lights? This, this is my favorite level so far in the full release. We just got launched. Dude, I'm in a mine cart. <gasps> I'm in a mine cart. I thought I had to jump out, but we're riding it. Dude, it's uh, it's I Am Fish Minecraft. We're in a mine cart. <laughs> no way. Uh, what? Okay, I just hit a wall. Hey, where are the diamonds? All right, let's jump out of here. Wait, is this where I just was? Is this the thing that just bounced me before? Where are we going? I'm a little confused. Uh-oh. <laughs> Give me back in that water. Guys, I'm not sure where we got to go. Okay, what if I just went through the minecart path? I don't know. Maybe that was just like an Easter egg thing. Okay, we're in this new area. Go in the water. Okay, we're in a new area. That minecart got trashed. Okay, where does this fountain take me if I don't fly? That's where the minecart was. Okay, let's try the mine cart again. What are we supposed to do with this thing? I feel like I should be able to go through that wall, right? How do I open this door? 
Oh, there's probably a way to open the door and then we go through the minecart. Wait, what's going on with this? There's like a danger sign right there. And it's like everything's hanging by a thread. Okay, we got a puzzle to figure out. I don't know. Oh, <gasps> no way. I hit the I hit the exclamation point, the danger sign, and it just broke everything. What? Okay, well that just broke everything. Oh, the water level's higher. Does this that doesn't launch me anymore? Okay, I wonder if these are like controllers that I have to hit. <gasps> Is there a button I gotta hit to open the door? Oh, I can just swim through. I think I can just swim through. <laughs> okay, I don't need to open the door. We made it. Give me that checkpoint. Dude, that was really cool. New area, new beautiful environment. Another minecart. I do love the minecarts. And fl get flung. Checkpoint over here. Give me that checkpoint. I got it. What a cool level. Uh-oh, I see another exclamation point. Hit it. There goes the minecart. Um, was I supposed to ride that? Wow. Okay, water level's going up again, dude. That's cool. It kind of reminds me of the bathroom level. Or, yeah, the bathroom level with the piranha. In the kitchen, where we kept increasing the water level. Guys, this is so cool. I love solving these puzzles. Okay, how am I going to get up there? I think I need a higher water level. Okay, at this point, I don't even know where I've gone yet. Is this a new place? <gasps> Waterfall? I think this is new. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Okay, make it through. <laughs> Dude, I don't know if I'm supposed to do this. I don't think this is right. Let's just see how far we can go. This is cool. Okay, I probably got to be in the minecart for this. Hey, that was kind of cool. Have we gone this way? Hey, these, these wires in the water, that's dangerous. Wires in water is deadly. All right, we're just going past all this stuff. Here we go. This looks like a place I need to be. And fling me? Whoops. Okay, you know what? <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to fly when they fling me. I just got to see where it takes me. Okay, fling. It flung me right on the exclamation point. Okay, water level's going back up again. We're moving on to the next fling area. Fling me? No. I was supposed to fly there. <laughs> Dude, this level is so cool. Okay, I think it helps to be pointing in the same direction. There we go. There we go. That's how you do it. <gasps> Uh-oh, we got a big red button. Guys, do we press the big red button? I think we press that big red button. Dude, is that going to like open all the doors? Okay, here we go. I hit the big red button. We got green lights. Okay, I bet all those doors are open now. Now what? All the doors are open. Oh, no, just this door. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What do we do now? Oh boy, the puzzles are getting difficult. Where does this red wire lead to? Follow the red wire. Although I see a checkpoint up here. Can I get the checkpoint? Give me the checkpoint. Give me that checkpoint. We got the checkpoint. Okay, this, maybe this will take me where I need to go. Yes. And we're in here now? <laughs> Dude, I am so lost at this point. I have no idea if this is where I'm supposed to go, but hey, it looks right. Yeah, this this looks okay. Hey, <laughs> we're going from... <gasps> there we go. We got another big red button. Give me that big red button. Whoops, I missed it. Give me that big red button. Got it. Uh-oh, stuck in the thing. Okay, the other door's open. Wait, what door did that open? Oh, here's another button. Guys, we got a lot of buttons to open. Oh, we got a lot of buttons to press. There we go. The mine card is moving. Do I need to get in there? <laughs> okay. It's moving. We got another checkpoint. Do I see another button? Can I even get up there? We got the button and we're in the mine card. No way. Here we go. This is where I was trying to fly earlier that I couldn't. We're going down. <laughs> We're going down into the mine shaft. Where are my diamonds? Watch out for zombies and creepers and spiders. No. What? How is there this building right next to a big mine shaft? This music is amazing. 
Colin Burke, Bossa Labs report number 359. How did Dr. Robert not predict this? He should have known Bob's would eventually gain serious. Now they've escaped labs and began living across Barnardshire with what? no knowledge of what they're supposed to be. They were made for surgery. They were made to let anyone become a surgeon. And I'll be my son doesn't deserve a better future than that of a baker. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, so that guy said something, something was made to help with surgery. It sounded like he said Bob's? Something was made to help with surgery, not to go sentient, not to have its own, a mind of its own. And he said he was disappointed that his son became a baker. Guys, this baker was this guy's, this scientist's son or something? So whoever this scientist's son is, he's the guy who turned the bread into living bread and that bread oh this is a glass window that bread made our fish go crazy and this music is pretty spooky i like it though wow it's all overgrown in here okay i see another opening in the window yes we just made it this music is very scary okay there's a checkpoint there's a checkpoint way up there how do i even get up there oh no way. We just jump up here. A bob. Okay, so he's saying these bobs, whatever these bobs are, they're making things become intelligent. That's crazy. Okay, I gotta get this checkpoint. There we go. Get me in there. Okay, this is good. Oh, we got a piece of bread. Nice. Now where are we going? Are we going... Oh, the next one. Nice, dude. This is tough. This is tough. I want to see what these bobs are that they're talking about. Okay, make it in here. And then make it in here. No. Okay. You know, if I'm dropping all the way down, I think it's worth just respawning. Guys, I'm warning you. There's going to be a lot of respawns at the end of this one. <laughs> I'm respawning a lot. I don't think I'm going to get more than one star on this one. Ooh, that was good. But yeah, this is probably going to be a low score. Oh my goodness. Can I glitch in? We made it. <laughs> I don't know if I earned that one. But where are we going from here? <gasps> in that window? There's no respawns. Oh, there was no checkpoint. That's good. We made it. We got a stretcher. Dude, this is probably... I wonder if this is the the set for, like, Surgeon Simulator. Like I mentioned before, Boston Studios, they also made Surgeon Simulator. So maybe there's some assets here from that game. Okay. Get flung. Yes. Wait, I think I was supposed to go... <laughs> I think I was supposed to go into that bucket. Okay. We're in the bucket. The asset was right in front of him. No. Okay, so he's saying these bobs were made for surgery. Can I open this door? These bobs were made for surgery. He applied the blood of the blob to bread, and the bread came alive. So he, his theory is if he can bring the alive bread close to these bobs, he can find out which ones were made for surgery. I still don't know what a bob is. What's a bob? Uh-oh. That looks dangerous. Do you think I can hit it in place? It looks like it got knocked out of place. Okay, let's see if I can jump and hit it. Yes, we got it. What did that do? That powered something. <gasps> I bet it opened that door. Hey, that was a nice jump. I'm getting the hang of this guy. Okay, so I think it's going to power this to open the door. Opening the door. I'm kind of freaked out. We got an elevator. I'm kind of freaked out, guys. 
What are these bobs? We did it. 11 respawns. That wasn't as bad as I thought. Guys, what a cool level. Dude, I love that. We started out underground, then we ended up in the cave. We rode a mine cart. We ended up in this hospital or a laboratory or something. And we're learning more about the story about these bobs or something. Okay, well, guys, if you missed any of the other videos so far, I'll put a link on the screen to the playlist. And also, if you didn't see it, guys, you got to check out my most recent Deer Simulator video. I installed some Deer Simulator mods and I found a secret chainsaw. I got to say, the deer looks pretty crazy with the chainsaw on. So, yeah, it was a lot of fun. We ended up fighting the boss with every weapon in the game. It was pretty pretty crazy so definitely check it out if you missed it but guys as always thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time